Sally, thank you so much for joining me tonight and talking to me about what you experienced today at the Nationals game. Take me through your experience. Where were you sitting and what were you hearing when all this was going on? Yeah, so we were sitting um, right under the uh, Jumbotron screen mm -hmm. and uh, it was bottom of the sixth and we heard five loud bangs um, and it was firework night. So we, I didn't really think much of it. Maybe, you know, they were testing it or someone accidentally shot one off. But uh, not till a couple seconds later um, were people uh, starting to duck and run and the uh, players were being uh, rushed off the field. Um, it, it took maybe eight or ten minutes until finally someone came over the PA uh, telling people to, um, you know, stay inside the stadium and that the, the accident was outside of the stadium and that it was safer to stay inside. So for those eight or ten minutes, Callie, what was going through your mind and what were you doing? Were you taking cover at that point? Um, we, uh, we, we really didn't know what was going on at mm -hmm. all. Uh, we heard loud bangs. We didn't know if it was shots or not. Um, we were actually on the opposite side of the field from where it was. Uh, so we just stayed where we were, um, knowing that uh, we could get up and find a safe space if we needed to. Um, there were people around us who were like, let's go. We're, we're getting out of here. Uh, not sure where they went, but uh, people were ru rushing towards the exit. When and you saw those police outside and so, so when you saw the players start to, you know, be ushered off the field, run through the dugout, run in the tunnel, you started to think what something was going on there. What was that like seeing the players be taken off the field? Uh, it was very unusual. We knew something was happening. We just didn't know what. Um, uh, it was definitely scary, um, not knowing what was going on and seeing everyone scurrying and everyone else not really knowing what's going on. People running all around, not knowing what to do, going in all different directions. <laughs> the videos we've seen and we've seen yours as well. It looked like complete chaos, as you said, because no one really yeah. knew what was going on there. When did you feel safe right. again? Um, I think I felt safe again when someone finally came over the PA system and was like, just stay where you are. It's safer inside instead of out of the uh, building. We're working with uh, the police to, you know, uh, make sure everything's all right. And when you found out that those were, in fact, gunshots, at first you thought they might be fireworks, but when you found out they were gunshots, what went through your mind? Um, honestly, I was just, I, there were so many thoughts going through my head, like, what should we do? Should we go? Should we stay? You know, um, there were people yelling like all like just all these sorts of things like take cover. You know, um, it, it was definitely lots of thoughts in my head and just all of them just very scary. <laughs> Had you ever been to a Nats game before? Oh, yeah, many. Yep. Do you think it'll be a little bit before you're able to return? Because I can tell by listening to your voice that this shook you. <laughs> Yeah, it definitely shook me, um, but I don't think I don't think it'll uh, prevent me from going to another one. I'm I'm thinking about going to the rescheduled one tomorrow <laughs> at one o five. There we go. There we go. I like to hear that. But I know yep. it's it's got to be scary, you know, when you go down to a big event and something like this happens, that maybe that's in the back of your head, thinking, could this happen here? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely a thought. Callie, I'm so glad you're okay tonight. Thank you for the video that you sent in to us. And again, stay safe and enjoy the game. Try to enjoy the game tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bye, Callie. Thank you. So sorry you went through that today. Thank you so much. Have a good night. Thanks, you too.